Indian Deep Space Network is a network of large antennas and communication facilities operated by the Indian Space Research Organisation to support the interplanetary spacecraft missions of India. Its hub is located at Bayalalu, a village about 25 kilometres from Bangalore, India. It was inaugurated on 17 October 2008 by the former ISRO chairman G. Madhavan Nair. The main tracking antenna was designed and commissioned by Hyderabad-based Electronics Corporation of India Limited at a cost of 65 crore rupees, about 13 million dollars. Topic: Introduction The network consists of the ISRO Telemetry, Tracking and Command Network augmented by a fully steerable 18 m and a 32 m DSN antenna which improves the visibility duration when compared with the existing ISTRAC system. The Indian Deep Space Network implements a baseband system adhering to Consultative Committee for Space Data Systems (CCSDS) standards, thus facilitating cross-support among the Telemetry Tracking Command (TTC) agencies. The two antennas at the Bayalalu complex have built SAN support facilities. A fiber optic link will provide necessary communication link between the DSN station and SCC, NCC, ISSDC. The 18 m antenna is provisioned to receive two downlink carriers in S-band and two carriers in X-band RCP and LCP, whereas the uplink is either RCP or LCP. It has a G.T of 30 39 dB, K 45 degrees elevation, clear sky for S, X-band, the 32 m antenna is of a wheel and track design. The antenna is designed to provide uplink in both S-band and X-band either through RCP or LCP. The reception capability will be in both S-band and X-band simultaneous RCP and LCP. It can receive two carriers in S-band and two carriers in X-band. The system will have a G.T of 37.5, 51 dB, K 45 degrees elevation, clear sky for S, X band. The station may be controlled remotely from the ISTRAC Control Center at Bangalore. The IDSN facility in Bayalalu also houses the ISRO Navigation Center Inc. It was launched on 28 May 2013 by V. Narayanasamy. The center became active on the 12th of June 2013 at the time of launch of IRNSS-1A, the first of the Indian Regional Navigation Satellite System series of satellites. The Inc has a high stability atomic clock. It will be used to coordinate across 21 ground stations in India. Topic: <laughs> Antennas other than ISTRAC. 32 m antenna The main antenna is a 32 m deep space antenna. The wheel and track 32 m antenna is a state-of-the-art system that supported the CHANDRAYAAN-1 mission operations. It is currently supporting Mars Orbiter mission This is co-located with 18 m antenna in the IDSN site at Bayalalu. A fiber optics, satellite link will provide the necessary connectivity between the IDSN site and spacecraft control center, network control center. This antenna is designed to provide uplink in both S-band and X-band either through RCP or LCP. The reception capability will be in both S-band and X-band simultaneous RCP and LCP. It can receive two carriers in S-band and one carrier in X-band, simultaneously. The system will have a G.T of 37.5, 51 dB, K 45 degrees elevation, clear sky for S, X-band. The base band will adhere to CCSDS standards facilitating cross-support among the space agencies. The station is also equipped for remote control from the ISTRAC Network Control Center NCC. Topic: 
Topic: 18 meters antenna. The second antenna is an 18 meter deep space antenna. Topic: 11 meters antenna. The third antenna is an 11 meter terminal antenna. Topic: CHANDRAYAAN1. The Indian Deep Space Network has been built to track and support India's first lunar mission, CHANDRAYAAN1, an unmanned lunar exploration mission. It was launched on the 22nd of October 2008. The IDSN was used for tracking, orbit control and housekeeping operations of India's lunar mission for its entire duration of operation planned was two years though achieved only 312 days. IDSN began to track Chandrayaan 17 minutes after its launch from the Satish Dhawan Space Launch Center at Sri Harikota, when the satellite separated from the launch vehicle. Topic: Mars Orbiter Mission. IDSN is being used to track the ongoing Mars Orbiter Mission, MUM, also known as Mangalyaan. 